I'm Nan Mantle and I'm the principal at Will Clay Public School. And I, uh, I'm going to talk a little bit about how we've been using Google Docs at Will Clay. It was new to us here this year, this school year, and when our tech lead Elton C came and uh, said this is a great way to you know, uh, start sharing documents, it's very pure easy. and easy to use, I was really interested. So he had uh, trained his, his students his grade, uh, in the grade five, six class uh, to use Google Docs and then uh, asked interested teachers if they would like their classes to learn. So that uh, you know involved a lot of classes uh, from all age groups in the school, very, very interested. And so Elton's class, they were the experts and he worked with other uh, classes and they were beginners and explorers. And um, a lot of classes learned very quickly, the students learned very quick, quickly how to use Google Docs, how easy it was, how efficient it was. Uh, from there, um, staff got very interested, and Elton said, "Well, I'll, you know, I can I can help you." And so, my piece in that was to support Elton and actually to give him uh, some time to go into classes and partner with teachers and work in their classrooms. Um, you know how to integrate this into the lessons. So, in one instance, uh, Elton worked with uh, three other teachers, and they were focusing on a, a lesson around uh, grade three letter writing. So Elton was in on the planning. It was like a four C's model. There was the planning and uh, then the teaching of the lesson and the debriefing. And uh, Google Docs were an integral part of uh, the lesson. Hi, my name is Jason and this is my partner, Sajibin. We'll be interviewing each other about Google Buddies. What is Google Buddies, Jason? Google Buddies is a program where students teach other students how to use Google Docs. How'd you do it, Sajibin? We went to the library, went to classes, were there and we taught them how to use Google Docs. What did you teach them? We taught them how to log on, how to go to the website, how to make a document, and how to insert videos and pictures. experts go down to help Google Explorers. What did you feel? I felt I felt very happy at first, but when I got down, I felt nervous because I had three new, three new uh, fresh uh, Google Explorers. So then when the days got went on, it, it, was, it was getting easier to teach them. So Kiki, what are Google Buddies? Google Buddies are experienced Google Docs users teaching the Google Explorers how to use Google Docs. So should we ask, how do we do it? We do it by telling them what to do and they do it. It's a hands-on activity, so it's really fun. So Kiki, what did you teach them? We taught them students how to use documents, presentations, drawings, and spreadsheets. Also, we taught them how to share the pieces of work and how to insert a picture on, the, on their pieces of work. From um, learning from teaching the Google Explorers, I learned a lot of things. The first thing I learned was that you should always be supportive and patient while teaching people. I also learned a lot of things on Google Docs that I didn't learn in class. The last thing that I learned uh, is the different way that people learn that helped me understand others better. <laughs> drawing when you paste the picture you can actually draw on top of the picture and when you learn through communicating it when you communicate with a younger student and the older student is actually different because when you're communicating with the younger student it might you might need to talk slower and maybe talk to them a, while, a little while and explain them but when you're talking to an older student it's just way easier because you can just say, explain it really easily because they understand why is a student teaching a student better than a teacher teaching a student? I think that it's better and more effective on the students by having another student teaching them because we have that same connection to as student to student. And I also feel like they enjoy it.
person or like a teacher because I was actually teaching kids and I've never actually went through this experience before. It was really good. And I actually felt more matured up and I felt like, oh, I'm teaching them, I'm teaching them. I'm so happy. Yeah. It's better for us to teach the students because we can really engage with them. Why do you like Google Doc? We like Google Docs because it has all the programs and we can share it with everyone. Google Docs is better than Microsoft Office because with Microsoft Office, that document is limited to only that computer unless you save it to your USB or email it. With Google Docs, the document is automatically saved when you stop typing for a few seconds and it can be accessed by any device when you log into it. I think it is better because a teacher is going to go like, make them sit down and go blah, 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 this is your lesson, la, la, la. But when we teach them, they'll actually get excited and we're so much better than teachers. I like to do that because if you forgot your homework at home or school, you'll be in big trouble. And if it's a Google Doc, you just log into Google Doc and your homework will be ready. Google Buddies is a great way to teach children how to do many things. We had the opportunity of learning Google Buddies or Google Apps through Mr. C who showed us how to get onto the Google Apps. And then I had a chance to attend a workshop in which I learned how to use Google Apps um, better. Um, we then collaborated with a grade three teacher who I do prep coverage for. We were able to get the children onto Google Apps, get them working with Google Apps. This avoided a lot of paper. Um, it hopefully will help the parents um, see many of the children's work. They were able to translate the document into their own language as we have a high ELL community. And it's been a great, great adventure because we are able to plan the teacher and myself together on Google Apps. We've been able to have them do experiments, put pictures in, and it's been very easy. As a teacher librarian, I've been using Google Apps with many ages, all the way from grade one all the way up to grade eight, and it's been amazing.